So you guys may be asking yourselves, well, you say, you've seen my uh, retro gaming station, and nowhere in the video do you see a uh, Super NES, and you may be asking me, well, J-Bug, how are you going to play these Super NES games? So you know what I had to do? Hmm. Here we go, the unboxing. Let's open this little one first. Didn't really need a knife for that. <clears throat> and I got this thing wrapped up with bubble bubble wrap like crazy. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. All right, we have a um, Super NES controller. Okay. Um, looks like it's in pretty good shape. It's not really clean. I can see some. Um, stains here and there but I think we can clean it up and and uh, make it presentable alright uh, the button seems to all work fine and it is the original Super Nintendo controller I was gonna get a brand new uh, third party controller but I read the reviews and some of the reviews said that uh, the controls were not precise and uh, there were some delays between the actual command and the, the actual gameplay so got the original Super NES and here's the uh, main unboxing it is the um, NES Super NES Genesis Tri System Retron 3. Okay, let's get this open. Comes in a nice box. It plays NES, Super NES, and Genesis games. It has wireless remote controls. I mean, uh, not remote control, I'm sorry, controllers. All right, let's open this bad boy up. All right. And that's what it looks like on the inside. Uh, Amazon.com, of course, purchase and um, about sixty-five dollars with ship. Well, not shipping, but I think total sixty-five dollars with two controllers. If they have not arrived. Uh, I I opted to get the uh, Super NES that you just saw, uh, the Genesis controller, and uh, uh, the regular NES 
Nintendo controller for this console because it can support the three different control the original controllers in addition to these wireless uh, controllers I am not going to use these wireless controllers I'm gonna leave them leave them in the bag I heard that they are kinda of difficult to use that uh, the remote system does not really work very well and it takes batteries and you know how I feel about batteries especially on uh, non-rechargeable batteries and controllers they just waste the money in my opinion so I'm not going to be using this I'm going to leave it in the bag for later collectible item whatever but yeah here's the system it's red in color pretty neat looking it's pretty light it's not very heavy at all uh, but um, pretty neat looking the, the doors on the um, cartridge slots are pretty springy and looks like it's well made the knobs feel pretty good it's alright uh, the buttons are kinda cheapish feeling but it's alright as long as it works I don't care um, aside from that it's a very neat looking console not very heavy like I said it takes the original controllers and also in the back you get the um, AV composite connection and the super video connection okay and of course the power jack alright that's the Retron 3 and get the power supply and that's it so once I get all of this hooked up and we'll test some of the games out and see if the Retron can play actually the all three games like it advertised and uh, I'll put some vids up alright thanks for watching folks the retro gaming station is 99.9 percent .9 complete now with the Retron 3 <laughs> Alright, uh, waiting for the controllers to come. The Super NES controller was not working. Uh, I examined the cord and there was a cut on the cord. The directional button did not work. Some of the uh, control pad buttons did not work. So we are sending that back. And hopefully the seller will uh, honor the return policy and send me a new one or give me a refund. Uh, the Genesis and NES controllers has not arrived, so we cannot test the games right now. But as you can see, now we have the N64, the Retron 3 that plays the NES, Genesis, and, and Super NES games with the Sega Dreamcast and the PlayStation 1. And uh, here at this area we have the PlayStation 2 and the Xbox 360 and the PS3 is in the living room and the other PS3 is in the basement um, in my movie theater so well, once we have all of the systems up and running with the controllers and everything else we shall be giving a complete demo of all of the retro game uh, consoles and uh, so cross your fingers guys hopefully the uh, uh, Genesis and the NES controllers will be in good con better condition than the Super NES controller was and uh, we should be up and running soon so thanks for watching.